This is one of the measures from the East African community that were put in place to stop the further spread of the coronavirus in the East African community that were put in place this Monday. There were instructions that were already in place in this community to curb the spread of COVID-19 in the ESC, including staying at home, suspending business activities, and closing the borders together so that the influx of people will not be the cause of the increase in the virus. The Secretariat of the East African Community says member states must step up their efforts to combat the virus. Those that do cross-border journeys, such as drivers and their helpers, should be screened for the virus such that they don't spread it. The drivers, as well as their helpers, must be monitored to the point of loading and unloading. Those that are showing signs should be put in isolation for 14 days. Those that test positive for the virus in a particular country should not be repatriated to their home country before they are cured. Truck drivers are also required to be tested twice a month and before traveling to the region. Cargo drivers in other countries or transit should be provided with rest areas and protected from public contact in order to prevent the spread of the coronavirus. The East African community is urging member states to choose products or other essentials in their daily lives that need to be exported and more that need to be added to the list and should be notified. On the other hand, member states should also continue to encourage industrialists to process domestic products within the countries so that they can recover economically from the coronavirus and that it should be reduced in the region. Promoting the production of equipment to fight against such as facial masks, hand sanitizers, among others, within the member states is also an important thing to be done. Other provisions of the directive include that cargo vehicles must be sprayed, drivers should be wearing facial masks, and use technology to transact, present other documents needed to facilitate border and customs services to avoid delays, and better share information. Authorities must first confirm whether drivers and their helpers are tested before receiving any services. The East African community says now that the region and the world are currently facing a coronavirus pandemic, the quality control of food or chemicals entering the member states must continue to be in the best interests of the health of the citizens. The coronavirus has severely disrupted the flow of goods and services in the region and the world at large, which is why strong measures have been put in place to ensure that the flow of people and services, trade and business resumes as usual.